we played didn't win the next week. And uh, it didn't mean that we <coughs> were at all dirty. We didn't do anything illegal. But we just played harder than other people. And if you can develop that mindset, it will take you a long way. Coach is a guy that means so much to me. Uh, he means so much to everybody that ever played for him. And uh, to have a guy like that care enough to come down and speak to us means a lot to me. And uh, our players were dialed in, and there's a lot of wisdom in those years. You know, all our guys are college football junkies, football junkies, and anytime you can have a, a legend come in and speak to you, you get a chance to, you know, pick up nuggets here and there. And, and, and a lot of what, uh, you know, he said is what we're trying to do here. Off the football field, he, he stressed to us about how academics and how, you know, integrity as a person and character as a person breeds, you know, a great football team. And coming from, you know, a soft-spoken guy like that, uh, it means the world of uh, being able to get every bit of knowledge that we can. The thing that, uh, that uh, makes the uh, difference is, is chemistry and its attitude and unity of purpose. And so if you can get players who are willing to sacrifice for each other and for the welfare of the program, uh, you've got about 50% of the battle won, and uh, and I think he works at that pretty hard. I think probably his, his team is more unified. They know him better. They know the system better, and and I think uh, having had a year of experience will, will make a big difference. You play in the present. You stay in the present all the time, and you give it your very best effort, and you continue to do that. Uh, eventually it will pay dividends. My dad was a captain for uh, Coach Osborne in his second year uh, actually at Nebraska. So I, I knew all about Coach Osborne growing up and then you know obviously growing up in Lincoln I uh, went to Nebraska games every Saturday. Growing up for me he was a, he was a legend in the state of Nebraska. Um, he was a guy that not only was uh, revered for how good he was as a football coach, more importantly uh, what type of character he had. Uh, what type of a leader he was. I think they, uh, they approach football similar to what we did at Nebraska. I think the, the relationships with the players are good. I think the respect level is good both ways. And um, so I think, I think the upside is, uh, is pretty good here. Coach Frost and Coach Osborne, from the stories I've heard and the chances, the few chances I've gotten to speak with him and then getting to learn under Coach Frost, I mean, there, there's a lot of parallels. Now they don't run anywhere near the same offense, but they run the program similarly, and it's, it's a blessing to get to play under Coach Frost and, and indirectly under Coach Osborne. I admire him as a coach. Obviously his record speaks for himself, but I admire him more as a man. Uh, he stands for everything that's good in college football and in life. Well, I'm very proud of him. Well, he's, he's had a breadth of experience at, um, and a, a good level of preparation, which lots of people haven't had. and. Uh, coach both sides of the ball and that's very helpful to, to have had experience doing both so I think he, he's got a, a tremendous about, amount of, of upside potential here Now we're going into year two. Just overall, uh, I think our guys, especially returning, have a really good grasp of what we're trying to get done on all three sides of the ball. Games being around the corner, uh, you know, school starting, it's it's a big difference from, you know, fall camp where it was, you know, every every day it was football, you know, wake up, football, go to sleep, football. Obviously we haven't played the games yet, so we just gotta take it game by game. We got a we got a really good schedule, a tough schedule. Knowing all the fans, they they are excited to go, they're probably even more excited than us, but they are excited and reminding us, hey, August thirty first, how to we ready for that, how the season gonna go. It just add more fuel knowing that hey, you yeah, got the fan support and season right around the corner. One, two, three.